and guru is not used together uh, by the way in the wicca tradition and in the magical lore uh, the word brew is used for you know when you're brewing uh, herbs in uh, in water jaise hum kadha bolte hain hamare yahan pe word kadha hai hai na ke bahut sari jadi butiyon ko pani mein dal ke hum usko uska kadha banate hain usko brew kaha jata hai normally and oil is not the word used with brew but i love to use it because i brew herbs in oil and so i call it oil brew right uh, in the tradition of bikado you won't find this word so uh, what is what is oil brew it is basically um, you know you take some base oil uh, we take some base oil and uh, put inside some herbs for those of you who have done divinations with me remedial divinations you have charts with you where you know what kind of herbs you can use but otherwise uh, very normally speaking it's the best uh, uh, the best concoction and the best thing that you can do is you take your garam masala take your cloves and uh, peppercorns and um, cinnamon cardamom uh, even uh, you know the the star anise and um, जावी पत्र होता है जो बे लीव यू नो टेक बीज एंड ब्रू देम इन द ऑयल यू नो लेट देम लेट देम तेल को अच्छा से गर्म करना और उसमें ये गर्म मसाले को थोड़ा सा पाउंड करके जस्ट पाउंड इट अ लिटिल नॉट डोंट मेक अ पाउडर जस्ट बीट इट क्रश इट अ लिटिल टू मेक इट यू नो टू लेट द ऑयल पेनेट्रेट थ्रू एंड लेट द एरो कम राइट and uh, put put that into the oil and this is normally you know isko ubala jata hai kafi der tak bahut dheeme aanch mein acha now there are two ways of doing this heating process uh, the traditional you know brews were made outdoor on uh, very important moon nights you know moon phases when there's a full moon or when there's a you making a protection uh, brew then you know we do it on no moon day amavasya ke din full moon is a very good day but you can do it indoor also so the traditional method is they do it outdoor with logs of wood and burn fire and put a big cold ron you know like a kadhai badi si ek kadhai laga kar ke us pe uh, herbs dal kar ke tel ko acha garam kiya jata hai and uh, you as a practitioner who is brewing something very interesting prepares a spell or prepares a statement a power statement that you want to infuse into this oil right and you go around the cauldron you go around the cauldron with a long wooden stick or a magic wand and cast this uh, you know power statement onto the oil um by going round and whispering it and looking into the oil again and again you know put on some very nice music and you know you spend spend a good lo- a good lot of time around the oil process so that the entire intention is gone into the oil then let it cool down completely we strain it or sometimes with the spices itself you store them into nice uh, air tight bottles you know for use now what kind of use does one uh, have with uh, you know these oil brews um many 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 uses can be done so if you don't want to do it outdoor in a cold room like that and we are all in living in apartments and you know smaller houses now so you can do it in a in a normal vessel बट कढ़ाई में कर सकते हो आप छोटी कढ़ाई में या फिर अच्छा थिक बेस वाला जिसमें कॉपर बेस होता है उस टाइप का भगोना लेके यू कैन पुट योर यू नो ऑयल इन टू इट एंड डू इट ऑन योर गैस स्टव बट कीप इट वेरी स्लो फ्लेम बेटर स्टिल इज टू कीप अ डबल बॉयलर डबल बॉयलर इज लाइक यू नो यू गेट यूटेंसिल्स दीज डेज इन विच यू कैन मेल्ट वैक्स and you can melt you know for soap making you get a double boiler that means there's a there's a there's a utensil and within that utensil there's another utensil and in between these two utensils there's a space in which you can fill up water you know so double boiler if you type on amazon you will get it it's called a double boiler and they're very nice they, it doesn't uh, harm the oil you know the the heat is uh, the heat process is so spread out that it doesn't harm the oil and doesn't kill the vital things uh, you know present in the oil so you can double boil it or you put it directly on the you know vessel and and heat it on the gas but keep it very slow flame so that um, you know slowly it's warming up and then you put your spices into it now um, there are three four things i will step by step uh, explain to you number one what do you use these brews for we use these brews for anointing you know to put it on pulse points 
you make a beautiful brew for prosperity you can make a beautiful brew for your um, own affirmation that you have or your past statement that you have or uh, you could make a you know brew for attracting love in your life or um, success and promotion you know anything that that you or even collectively you could make a beautiful power statement for yourself writing down like a small poem you know like a small stanza uh, a beautiful uh, stanza L let's say i i will narrate one spell to you so the, i i can see that there are some of them over here who have not done the remedial divination with me and they don't know how to make spells uh, a big a, a beautiful stanza poetic stanza is what a spell is and it should be customized don't borrow spells from here and there they're they're of no use they're not your heart language you know so suppose i i i wanted to say something to you for um uh you know overall prosperity um i've written down a spell just to read it out to you uh grounded supported and nurtured by the earth the power of the light and god surrounds me protected and showered with grace and wisdom everything auspicious comes to me yeah something like that the last line could be all the treasures of this universe come to me you know you could have something like that the other day uh, there was there was a girl for whom i made a beautiful spell and i often say this because mujhe wo rat gaya spell i often say this in the remedial class um healthy wealthy healthy wealthy lucky and bright slim and beautiful flexible and strong full of energy and light peaceful joyous adored and abundant so blessed and gifted i am she should put all her adjectives to the, together and uh, made a spell so you know you, the first thing the first requirement is you write down what you want you write down what you want and for people who are in a family for instance you could make a spell for the family you know like uh, something that puts you all together into harmony there's good health there's a lot of money coming in there are a lot of opportunities this protection around the family no evil touching etc you could make a spell for your family uh, so the first thing in the in the whole process is to write down a spell or write down a power statement i can i can also call it power statement right second thing is to take the oil to prepare the oil to take the oil what kind of oils do you use for brewing uh, we call them base oils we use base oils oils that are not too heavy and oils that can accommodate very easily everything else in them you know for instance our normal refined oil that you're using in the house sunflower oil can be used you can use sunflower oil you can use uh, almond oil you can use jojoba oil you can use um, uh, apricot oil coconut oil you know so something that uh, is suitable for the kind of use you want with the brew so for instance if you want to use it for your body for on your body then don't take um, you know uh, uh, lighter oils take good oils like you could take a mixture of you know a base oil sunflower or apricot oil put in some almond oil put in some jojoba oil and uh, even wheat germ oil or you can even put your vitamin e capsules in it because you know you're going to use it on your body so you can make it healthier but if you want to make a oil for instance today in today's class i'm going to teach you how to make oil for your puja how to make oil to light a lamp you know how to spell cast a oil uh, you prepare a oil uh, brew store it in a bottle and use it every day to light a lamp in your house in the evening so that you are you know spreading vibes of happiness and joy in the family and i'm going to teach that after i explain you the process okay so the first thing is to make the power statement the second thing is to choose your oil what oil you want and sunflower oil is very nice sesame oil is very good you know sesame oil is good especially aapko diya ke liye banana hai agar puja ke liye banana hai to sesame oil is very good don't take mustard oil because it's very uh, ugra you know it's very aggressive the smell is very aggressive and it doesn't accommodate aroma oils um, you know other aroma oils within uh, itself so the, avoid mustard oil but take sesame sesame is very nice and i use cold pressed oils they're very good they're very pure so you can even take coconut oil coconut oil is also very accommodating to all the aromas bahut acha hota hai coconut oil so the first thing is power statement second thing is choosing the oil the third thing is what are you going to put inside you know what are you going to put inside for sure all these garam masalas all these spices hot spices like uh, long elaichi bay leaves and all 
uh, especially if you're using, if you're making a brew for puja, then the garam masala is excellent. And then you could, you know, even mix some mm -hmm. more oils into it, essential mm -hmm. oils into it. Okay. Some of the, uh, you know, combinations of beautiful oils that are very nice for puja and very good for like uh, making a brew that can be used in the house for housewarming or for the altar or for anointing to everyone. Like a ittar, you can anoint everyone and that smell stays with them the whole day. Just like we put oil in the house before the house. You can put oil in the house. You can just give little oil to everyone to put it on their body and they can go with that energy, you know. And uh, so I'm uh, uh, dictating, uh, if you have a pen and pencil, please write down. I'm dictating. Uh, about five or six combinations of essential oils that go very well with your base oil to make it very aromatic and very um, intriguing and very interesting and very intense. Okay, so the first one, these are all very special combinations that these make these combinations your oil brews make, they're very special holy combinations that make your, uh, you know, oil brews very, very um, interesting and very intriguing, very penetrating. And they're very spiritual blends, okay? They're very spiritual blends. First one, frankincense, myrrh, cedar wood. Frankincense, myrrh, cedar wood. A few drops of frankincense, a few drops of myrrh oil, and a few drops of cedar wood oil in your base oil can make it very aromatic. And if you've put garam masala already, it doesn't matter. These oils add a, a, a special character, you know, to your uh, brew oil. Uh, so the first was frankincense, myrrh, cedar wood. Instead of cedar wood, you can even use sandalwood. It makes it even, uh, even more you know, intense and beautiful. Then the next combination, sandalwood, cedar wood, orange and lime. Orange, lime along with sandalwood and cedar wood. So four of these oils. Then sandalwood, lang lang, cinnamon. A very beautiful combination, very dramatic uh, combination. So this is sandalwood, lang lang, cinnamon, um, and uh, oh yeah. then next somebody has written some question. Let me read this. Can we put fragrance to it? Yes, I'm, I'm coming to it. Then next one, orange, lime, cardamom, orange, lime, cardamom, then rosemary, juniper, sandalwood. This is very healthy. This is very, very healthy. And this smell stays for a long time. Rosemary, juniper, and sandalwood. And then basil, geranium, pine, and vetiver. Basil, geranium, pine, and vetiver. These, all these blends are very spiritual blends. And they work as a geranium, high pine, and vetiver. Okay, these are spiritual blends. Hai. Prosperity or abundance ke liye do blends de, uh, bata rahi hu, jo ki spiritual bhi hai aur solar plexus pe bhi kaam karte hai. Cinnamon, cedar, allspice, ginger and pine. Cinnamon, cedar, allspice, ginger and pine. And one more. Pacholi, clary sage, frankincense and wild orange. Pacholi, clary sage, frankincense, and wild orange. If you don't get wild orange here, you can use neroli or bergamot. If you don't get wild orange, you can use bergamot or neroli. Okay. And one more, rosemary, lavender, and frankincense. This is a dramatic combination. Rosemary, lavender, and frankincense. Okay. So now, the first thing you have done is created a power statement. Second thing you have done, is you put together the base oil, the oil in which you're going to brew. Third thing, you've collected the essential oils that you want to mix with this. Whatever combination you want, you can do it. Okay? In oil ke drops, you will put it garam karne ke baad dalenge. Garam karne se pehle nahi dalenge. Jo aromatic oils, hai, jo essential oils, hai, they will be mixed with the main oil after the heating process, not before the heating process because they will evaporate in the heating otherwise. Hmm? So you will mix these essential oils in the oil, in, in the oil brew after, in the end, in the end. Okay? Step number four, you have put all the herbs in the oil. 
for instance, you've taken long elaichi, uh, dalchini, and uh, you know vetiver. You can take vetiver. Vetiver is that grass. Khas khas bolte na khas jo iske parde bante hain garmi mein. Vetiver le sakte hain aap. So take this, take these dry herbs and masalas in a bowl. Uh, in a bowl is like a wooden bowl in which we do spell casting, and for a long time. you know play play with these herbs play with these spices narrating the power statement you know keep repeating the power statement as if you're spell casting as if you're telling the herbs that i want this intention to go into you you know usko rub karo play karo apne ungliyon ko ghuma usme bahut der tak at least 20 21 times you should repeat your spell or power statement in the oil in the in the herbs or in the uh, you know spices theek hai उसके बाद यू कैन टेक अ मोटर एंड पेसल खल होती है जो उसमें आप इन स्पाइसेस को थोड़ा सा पाउंड कर लीजिए जस्ट पाउंड अ लिटिल बिट ब्रेक इट अ लिटिल एंड देन पुट दी स्पाइसेस इनटू द ऑयल इनटू द मेन ऑयल जिस कढ़ाई में आपने पकाना है इसको पुट द स्पाइसेस इनटू द ऑयल एंड देन लेट इट डबल बॉईल लेट इट ब्रू लेट इट ब्रू फॉर अ लॉन्ग टाइम लेट इट ब्रू फॉर अ लॉन्ग टाइम सम पीपल समटाइम्स इवन ब्रू इट फॉर अ कपल ऑफ डेज मतलब आज आपने गरम एकदम तेल गरम करके स्पाइसेस को डाला ढक्कन लगा के छोड़ दिया टुमारो अगेन हीट इट अ लिटिल एंड अगेन यू नो टेक यू टेक अ वुडन स्पैटुला और टेक अ वुडन स्टिक और टेक अ टूग ऑफ अ प्लांट एंड इवन कास्ट द स्पेल से द पावर स्टेटमेंट इवन इन द ऑयल वाइल इट इज हीटिंग अप यू नो कीप रोटेटिंग योर हैंड विद अ स्पैटुला और विद विद अ वुडन स्टिक एंड कीप रिपीटिंग द स्पेल इट्स लाइक यू इन्फ्यूजिंग द ऑयल विद ऑल योर इंटेंशन ठीक है ये एक दो दिन रिपीट भी किया जा सकता है हालांकि एक दिन करने से भी काफी होता है इट्स नॉट रिक्वायर्ड टू डू इट टू थ्री डेज राइट सो वंस यू पुट योर पावर स्टेटमेंट इनटू द ऑयल लेट इट कूल डाउन अ लिटिल देन यू पुट योर एसेंशियल ऑयल एंड अगेन मिक्स इट विद द यू नो स्पेलिंग अगेन विद द स्पेल कास्टिंग अगेन दैट मी नरेट द होल पावर स्टेटमेंट अगेन एंड अगेन एंड अगेन यू हैव टू बी वेरी श्योर दैट योर पावर स्टेटमेंट साउंड्स वेरी ब्यूटीफुल it sounds very beautiful and puts a smile on your face you have to make sure that your spell is really very beautiful okay um when you put the essential oils and then you cast the spell again keep it covered until it completely cools down and then you can strain it um with a ek channi mein ek bhagone mein strain karo and fill them up in in beautiful bottles you know which are for you know you get these kind of bottles aise bottles milte hain jisme oil store karte hain hum log uh the you know the this is very tight the cork has to be very tight it should be air tight you know your bottles in which you store your oil these should be preferably darker i put them in a, a closed cupboard that's why i don't use dark bottles much but uh mere pas hoti nahi hai itni kabhi kabhi to main isme store karti hu but i put them in a dark uh, closet you know so uh, light mein essential oils ki khushboo ud jati hai spell bhi वीकन हो जाता है यू नो सो दैट्स वाई शुड पुट इट इन अ डार्क बॉटल ब्राउन कलर के बॉटल्स मिलते हैं यू कैन यू कैन स्टोर योर स्पेल कास्टेड ऑयल इन दैट नाउ द यूज ऑफ द स्पेल कास्टेड ऑयल यू नो इफ यू हैव क्रिएटेड इट फॉर समवन, यू कैन क्रिएट इट फॉर समवन टू अट्रैक्ट मनी लव वट एवर वट एवर देन इतना सारा ऑयल मत बनाओ थोड़ा सा ऑयल बनाना एंड स्ट्रेन करके उसको पैक इन स्मॉल बॉटल्स एंड गिव द पर्सन रोलर वाली बॉटल्स मिलती हैं बाजार में यू गेट बॉटल्स विद रोलर्स यू नो द पर्सन कैन अनोइंट ऑन इन द हैंड एंड एक ही आदमी की उसके लिए इतना सारा ऑयल बनाने की जरूरत नहीं क्योंकि वो स्पेल किसी और को यूज नहीं करना है आपने ठीक है सो देन मेक इट वेरी स्मॉल बट इफ यू मेकिंग इट फॉर द फैमिली एंड फॉर द पूजा एज वी गोइंग टू डू अ demonstration today for the puja oil then uh, then you can take a 1 liter you know for instance i have taken a very ordinary 1 liter sunflower oil ki bottle liya maine and uh, i have already brewed some oil to show you you see this is a oil that i have already heated it up and there is vetiver in it and there is garam masala in it long cut ke dala hai bay leaves hain uh, i have also put uh, essential oils and uh, fragrances of sandalwood and saffron sandalwood and saffron i put in this so it's smelling of the hot spices as well as saffron and sandalwood it giving a very intense kind of a smell so this oil i've made for the uh for the puja for lighting a lamp now this is something that i want to teach you today you know i uh love to 
you know, bring the Western methods and uh, take you with the West because they're very, they're very appeasing and they're very uh, alluring. The Western spellcasting work is very alluring. But I want to take you, hold your hands and take you deep down into our culture to let you understand and make you understand that we have had this tradition of spell casting in a very different way. All our mantras are spells. Jitne humare paas mantra hai, sare spells hai. For instance, today we are, we are making the, you know, oil brew for puja, the oil brew for lighting a lamp, in a lamp. Aapne ek bottle, ek bottle ko pura brew kar liya, bada achha se usme. Humne spell kya daala hai? Usme smell, spell aap dal sakte ho, kuch bhi prosperity ka bhi, joh humne read kiya, wo bhi dal sakte ho, English spell bhi dal sakte ho. But we have some very beautiful mantras, you know, that are specific to creating, um, you know, uh, abundance and creating a lot of harmony in the family. Um, the other day, you know, I was listening to someone, uh, so he was, he was talking about the art of, um, praying, you know, how do you pray when you ask God for something or you ask the universe for something, uh, you know, why do you want to fragment everything into small bits and ask everything as if it's so long a prayer for you? Can't you ask something very crisply <clears throat> that kind of accommodates everything in one, in a sentence? Can't you ask something very crisply? Can you make a power statement which is like so crisp? So he gave a very beautiful example. He said that he was listening to a story from a saint that he was going to the forest and he was going to the forest. You know, he had the darshan of God and God asked him for a vardhan. So he said, you ask me what you want. So this intelligent man who was very poor, and he had no house and he was like, almost like, uh, you know, like a sadhu going everywhere. He said that in one, I, in one Vardhan, I want to ask everything. He asked for God that I want to see my grandson rule this kingdom. He said, I want to see my grandson rule this kingdom. And uh, so it was a very short sentence and he was granted. So the sadhu who was, you know, giving this uh, pravachan said that, in this one sentence, he asked for obviously a partner to get married and then a son and the son's son, grandson, you know, and ruling this kingdom means prosperity. And obviously he would be stationed in this place forever. So in this one sentence, he asked for so much, you know, so very intelligently, very, um, uh, you know, uh, very wisely sit down and write down the things that you want and Put them together in such a way but because they all will be connected to each other for sure. They will all be connected to each other. All your desires are fragmented. Put them all together, you know, and make a crisp, nice, beautiful, very smiling uh, statement. A past statement should make you smile, right? So we have a very beautiful mantra. It is said normally taught, um, uh, you know, to light a lamp in the evening. Sham ke time, diya jalate hai. bhi jalate hai lo. So, us time pe is uh, mantra ko bula jata hai. So, I will just say the mantra to you. And if somebody wants to note down, then I can share the, you know, the mantra with you as well. This one is, you know, sham ke time pe diya jalane ke time. It's very nice to, to say this uh, mantra. I have learned it in my childhood because my grandmother used to, you know, make us all children sing it, uh, say it. But uh, nowadays I see that many houses, they don't do it. Lighting a lamp is a very beautiful exercise. Very beautiful exercise. You have time, you have to but you have to the lamp. Because, you know, the flame, uh, the, the light and the flame represents Brahman himself. First of all, it represents knowledge and it represents Brahman and it represents light, Roshni. That itself is an indication and uh, it depicts removal of ignorance. It, it depicts removal of ignorance. That means anything that you are thinking, so lighting the lamp is the first indication that I'm bringing in the light of knowledge. I'm bringing in the light of knowledge. Also the mantra has arogyam and dhansampada, everything it has. It says like that. Shubhankaroti kalyanam Arogyam dhana sampada, shatru buddhi vinashaya, deepak jyotir namostute, deepak jyoti parabrahma, deepak jyoti janardhana, deepo haratu me papam, 
Deepak Jyoti Namostate. You see, in this very small, beautiful mantra, you have asked for Arogyam, Dhan Sampada, Shatru Buddhi Vinashaya, and then you're doing Naman to the light. That means you're doing Naman to the Brahman. Okay? Deepo Haratu Me Papam. Whatever ill I may have done, please banish it, eat it off. You know, so it's such a beautiful exercise to do. And if you spell cast all your herbs and the oil that you're making to make this, uh, you know, uh, to light the lamp every day, in pure herbs ko isi mantra se spell cast kar do. Is mantra ko 21 times bol ke herbs ko achche se apne haath mein guma lo. Uske baad crush karke, pound karke, tel mein dal do. Usko garam karke, let, let it, you know, brew a little. While it is brewing also spatula se isi mantra ko bolna. And then let it cool down, add your aroma oils and then uh, strain it and store it in the bottle. You will say the mantra 21 times and spell cast on the herbs, number one. Number two, put it in oil and let it brew for a while. Then uh, let it cool down a little, put essential oils and again, you know, cast the spell in it. Strain and store it in a bottle and use this oil to light the lamp every day. Okay, use this oil to light the lamp every day. Lighting the lamp is different from burning a candle. Always remember this. Candle is equally beautiful. Candle is equally beautiful and it has been there in the, in the Western lore. Uh, in all the civilizations uh, in the West, candles have been there. Oil lamps have, uh, are very few. But oil may, aapki spell casting work very profoundly. Hoti hai. And there are so many other things you can combine. You know, so la la lamps are certainly uh, more versatile to use. And um, in the in the bati, jo aap lamp lete ho, lamp bhi zada bada nahi lena. Rose ka jo lamp hota hai na, niranjan hota hai chota. This is more than enough. You know, you have a small niranjan you get. This is more than enough. The bati soaks in all the oil, so it doesn't spill also here and there. Itna hi oil dalna hai apne. And this this burns for about an hour, which is kind of more than enough. There is another way of um, you know uh, using oil and a and a uh, you know lamp. You see, you get these kind of wicks in the in the market. You know, there is a disc. If you can see this clearly, there is a disc and there is a bati. These are available online. They are called floating wicks. We call them floating wicks. So, in a small glass uh, which has water, water, putting some oil water in here. Pani ke upar oil dal rahi hoon. Dikh raha hai? Pani ke upar maine oil dal hai. I have put oil above the water so that I don't need so much oil. Uh, you can fill up the glass with oil also, but then that burns for, burns for a long time. Uh, if, if you want it to burn for about an hour or two, you don't need to, you know, um, fill up the whole glass. And this looks very beautiful. So I put the wick, I put the wick into it and I'm lighting it now to show you how this looks. It's a very beautiful lamp. And in fact, you can even continue with the, with the spell work after you've put the wick into the, into the glass as well. See, it looks very beautiful. You can, you know, the, this, this oil in the top is spell cast and it has your intentions into it. So when you're saying the Shubhankaroti Mantra and spell casting, doing the spell casting work, you can add some more words, you know, that you uh, don't find in the mantra. Kuch aur work hoga ya kisi ki tabet kharaab hogi ya kisi aur ka aapke parivar mein aur koi issue hoga. Write a sentence and add that. So you can add along with the mantra also another sentence in the spell casting of the masalas of all the garam masalas as well as when you are cooking the oil, when you are brewing the oil with the spatula, put all those sentences into the oil and pack it up and put it and light this every day in the evening. The spell goes everywhere in the house. The same oil if you have used good oils, the same oil can be packed into small bottles and can be given to people to use at home. You can keep a separate roller for somebody to put it on, on the pulse points. People can carry the, you know, the spell and the, and the protection of the spell with them through the day. You know, Get this it? oil brew now is like, um, is like, it has a very long shelf life. It has a very long shelf life. So you can, you know, prepare something that can last for months together, especially if you're making something that uh, uh, you want to use on the body like a protection oil, then the brew can be made with very beautiful oils like bijam oil, uh, almond oil, and you know, something that goes into the, into the skin very easily. Jojoba oil helps to penetrate deep into the you know, cells, epidermal cells. 
jojoba oil carries the aromas deep into your cells so if you're making a blend if you're making a brew for using it on yourself then you must add jojoba oil it's a heavy oil but it gets absorbed very nicely and it penetrates into the skin and you don't need jojoba oil if you're using it if you're making the brew for the lamp jo humne diye ke liye lamp bata lamp ka oil bata hai uske liye jojoba dalne ki zarurat nahi uske liye aap ordinary sunflower oil ya sesame oil use karo because diye ka diye ka tel hai wo usme you don't need to put all these expensive oils that it won't make any difference what i mean it's not going to make any difference you to you to you know let go release the spell into the into the area where you're lighting the lamp so you don't need almond oil or you don't need expensive oils for that use uh, your reasonably priced oils like sunflower oil sesame oil ye dono bahut badhiya hote hain oil usme aap perfume oils dal sakte hain essential oils dal sakte hain maine ye hamesha dekha hai ki essential oils are pure oils and they you know they just uh, uh, fade out very soon because especially if you are keeping the oil in the open and it's letting a light in a lighted place etc wo jaldi ud jate hain so it's nice always to use a perfume oil you know along with your essential oils that holds all the essential oils together as well perfume oil jo hota hai bahut strong hota hai and all these oils are available in in uh, you know your agarbatti ki dukane hoti hain inme sab mein milta hai itar milta hai itar milta hai which is very strong again uh you also get some very beautiful resins that can be brewed in oils you know resins like uh, amber um uh, a lot of uh, you know these islamic practitioners they use a lot of itar and resins so amber ka resin milta hai uska powder milta hai amber resin ka powder milta hai us powder ko aap oil mein brew kar sakte hain when your oil is heating up along with your you know your uh, spices what you put long wagara uske sath aap amber ka powder dal sakte hain aur bhi do teen bade achhe khushboo wale uh, resins milte hain that you know are very aromatic musk hota hai musk ka bhi resin ye log bechte hain agar patti walon ke paas milta hai uh, musk powder bhi milta hai sandalwood powder bhi milta hai these all can be you know um, i mean it th- this is a passionate work this is a work of a uh, lot of passion and lot of excitement so if you're if you really love to do this then you should buy all things buy all the necessary things and have a separate table for your blending work and for your brewing work you know and you can prepare custom made oils um, for people as uh, well with these combinations that i have given you you know you could you could use these combinations are very very beautiful they very intense and very beautiful ye jo blends maine abhi dictate kare aapko you can use this and prepare custom made oils for people and put them into bottles and give them to people for using they have a very long shelf life can be you know can be used for like 6 months ek saal tak bhi uski khushboo jaati nahi in fact it you know you know like how wine is kept uh, you know stored to make it more intense in the same way these oils if they are on the shelf for a long time if you put resins in, into them and these uh, aromatic spices into them after about a few months the smell is completely intoxicating and it's different it's different from what it was when you brewed it you know because it uh, proves over a time it proves and it you know it stays um uski khushboo badal jati hai puri bahut sundar hote you can even put dried fresh herbs like rose petals um you know dry flowers like lavender buds and um, uh jaise alag alag khushboo ke flowers sukhe sukhe milte hain jadi buti ki dukanon mein bhi milte hain aajkal supermarkets mein bhi milte hain you can put those and also put them in the brew uh, so that it it's more magical more intoxicating more intense and you know i mean you you need to think about all the different ways also when you prepare the brew and when you jaise maine abhi ye lamp ke liye brew aapko bataya ab ye brew banane ke baad mein ab ye cool down ho gaya hai theek hai isme main aur bahut sari cheeze add kar sakti hu i can add some lucky coins some silver coins of lakshmi and ganesh you can you can take a cinnamon stick i've put something here to show you you can take a cinnamon stick and wrap around a, a, a you know a note a, a dollar note ya 100 rupaye ka 50 rupaye ka note wrap karo उस नोट के ऊपर आप अपनी इंटेंशन भी लिख सकते हो फॉर इंस्टेंस यू नो इन 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 दिस नोट देर वॉज समथिंग दैट आई है इसको निकालना पड़ेगा टू शो यू सो आई रिटर्न डाउन ऑन द नोट समथिंग कैन यू सी दैट सो द इंटेंशन इज रिटर्न ऑन द नोट एंड देन यू कैन यू नो 
roll the cinnamon stick tied up with a with a nice beautiful mauli lal dhaga se band karke aap isko iske andar seedha dal sakte ho you can just put it straight into the oil and let it remain so the intention remains in the oil uh you know uh for a long long time and vibrations hoti you see everything in this in this universe is vibrations right you agree with me everything is vibrations your written things are also vibrating your intentions are vibrating into it what you draw vibrates in it for those of you who have learned yantras you've done remedial with me you've learned yantras apna siddh yantra bana ke kisi coin ke piche ya kisi uh, uh, lucky coins milte hain chinese coins wagaira milte isko apna siddh yantra dal kar ke wo dal diya um for good health uh, ya kisi ki padhai ke liye ek saraswati ka yantra banaya aur wo dal diya oil mein i mean it depends what intentions you want and you can put those intentions into and you know add on to this and store it for some time isko chhanne ki zyada jaldi nahi karna isko do teen din pada rehne do iske andar baad mein isko aap chhaniye so that the uh, you know the aur chhanne ke baad bhi agar isme se kuch cheeze utha ke usme dalni hai to dal dena you know, bejhijak se chhante hum keval isliye hai because if there is a powder that you have used if there is a, you know uh, and you don't want that to come into your anointing or you don't want to come that into your lamp then we strain otherwise straining is not required get it now any question somebody has written something here do we sieve it immediately after we brew after cooling or let the spices sit we let it sit divya we let it sit for a while let it sit and let it brew for a while and then you can channa to tabhi hai suppose i mean you strain it only when you want to give it to somebody in a bottle then you can strain it and give it but otherwise usme pada rehen do masala uh, can i add dhoop powder to the oil dhoop powder will discolor the oil and will create cloudiness Dhoop powder nahi dalte hain because there's a lot of other stuff which is mixed in the dhoop. So don't put dhoop Why powder in incense powder. Why do we need currency powder. note? Can we use a simple paper? Yeah, you can use simple paper. But the if the uh, you know uh, abundance and uh, money is an issue, and it is one of the important aspects in your spell and power statement, then uh, writing on a note seems to be very magical. it it seems to be very magical even on a coin you know you have a sikke hote hain sikke ke upar bhi apna yantra bana kar ke dal do usme yeah it has its own magic what do we do with the currency note afterwards you can burn it in the fire the currency note and the cinnamon stick and all the cardamom and all that jo masala hai aapka tel khatam ho gaya aur aapne dusra brew banana hai so all this old stuff just put it in a paper or put it in something and burn it in the fire Or, or put it in the ground. You can, you know, Remember, bury it in the garden. Personal spells, spells that are meant for your own use, shouldn't be burned. You sh- shouldn't burn them in a lamp in the house. Uh, you know, to let everyone in that spell. Personal spells. Make up anointing oils. Banao. Make oil that you will anoint and wear it yourself. Uh, spells which are for everyone. Only those spells should be used in a lamp. और अगर लैंप आपको जलाना भी है तो फिर वो आप अपने कमरे में अपने ऑल्टर में जला लो कोई चीज का आपने सपोज यू आर प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर एन एग्जाम और यू आर प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट मीटिंग और अ डील अ बिजनेस डील और समथिंग यू वांट टू प्रिपेयर समथिंग एंड यू प्रिपेयर बट यू बर्न द लैंप इन योर रूम इन योर स्पेस डोंट लेट दैट बी इन द कॉमन स्पेस या सो यू विल राइट स्पेसिफिकली योर क्वेश्चन रीना दैट Uh, you will write specifically about that property on the paper, and then put that in the, in the oil. You taken about a liter of oil. A liter of oil है उसमें मैंने एक दस बारा लौंग के दाने डाले हैं, एक दो दालचीनी के टुकड़े हैं, दो बे लीव्स हैं, एक मुट्ठी भर के मैंने वेटीवर ग्रास डाला है. There is no uh, this thing. Drops of oil का आप बोल सकते हैं हाँ कि चार पांच drops oil के बस नहीं होते हैं aroma oils के. For a liter of oil, you would need about 30 drops of um, essential oil in each of the you know jo aapne blend kiya hai usme se ek ek ke 20 25 drops hone chahiye so again what is the we can between, between perfume and essential oil perfume oil is chemically uh, chemically made in our laboratory and uh, essential oil is extract from organic uh, flowers and uh, barks and you know all parts of the plant the difference is exactly what is there in ayurvedic medicine and the यू नो केमिकल मेडिसिन उसमें कैसे फर्क होता है जो सॉल्ट आप लेबोरेटरी में बनाते हैं वो एलोपैथिक मेडिसिन होती है और आयुर्वेदिक मेडिसिन प्लांट एक्सट्रैक्ट होती है वैसे ही डिफरेंस है एसेंशियल ऑयल्स का परफ्यूम ऑयल का परफ्यूम ऑयल में प्राणा नहीं होता है एसेंशियल ऑयल्स में प्राणा होता है 
परफ्यूम ऑयल स्पेल कास्ट नहीं कर सकते आप असेंशियल ऑयल्स को स्पेल कास्ट कर सकते हैं आप पर परफ्यूम ऑयल हम जब डालते हैं थोड़ा सा वो स्मेल को होल्ड करता है और बहुत देर तक बांध के रखता है इसीलिए वी आर एडिंग इट लाइक एन एडेसिव वी आर एडिंग इट टू द ब्रू अदरवाइज इफ यू ओनली एड परफ्यूम ऑयल एंड स्पेल कास्टिंग इज नॉट वेरी इफेक्टिव या माफ और स्पेल डू वी नीड टू यूज फ्यूचर टेंस और प्रेजेंट टेंस प्रेजेंट टेंस ऑलवेज वरुण ऑलवेज प्रेजेंट टेंस वी यूज प्रेजेंट टेंस उसमें जैसे आई आई एम स्ट्रॉन्ग आई एम स्ट्रॉन्ग हेल्थी वेल्थी एंड वाइज यू नो वी मेक इट लाइक दैट आई एम स्ट्रॉन्ग हेल्थी वेल्थी एंड वाइज या इट मेक्स यू मेक्स यू पुट्स अ स्माइल ऑन योर फेस इसे आई एम स्ट्रॉन्ग हेल्थी वेल्थी एंड वाइज स्लिम एंड ब्यूटीफुल फ्लेक्सिबल एंड स्ट्रॉन्ग फुल ऑफ एनर्जी एंड लाइट इमीडिएटली इट पुट्स स्माइल ऑन योर फेस आता है ना हाँ माँ तुलसी लीव्स डाल सकते हैं हाँ जी डाल सकते हैं तुलसी लीव्स डाल सकते हैं कैम्फर तुलसी के लीव्स डाल सकते हैं यू कैन इवन पुट कैम्फर ऑयल अगर कुछ पेन के लिए वगैरह बना रहे हैं किसी के तो कैम्फर ऑयल डाल सकते हैं लैम्प के लिए दिए का जो लैम्प मैंने बताया इसमें ये जो ऑयल के कॉम्बिनेशन मैंने बताया ये बहुत सुंदर है और गरम मसाला वाला ब्रू बनाओ एंड देर इज नथिंग लाइक इट द होल प्लेस होल रूम स्मेल सो गुड एंड इट एक्चुअली एमिनेट्स अ लॉर्ड ऑफ पॉजिटिविज्म इन द हाउस लॉर्ड ऑफ पॉजिटिविज्म इन द हाउस बहुत स्पेल कास्टेड लैम्प ऑयल इज लाइक अमेजिंग थिंग टू ग्रो वेरी वेरी अमेजिंग थिंग टू ग्रो या डू यू गेट ऑल काइंड ऑफ परफ्यूम ऑयल एज यू गेट असेंशियल ऑयल या यू गेट यू एंड पीपल सेल देम एज परफ्यूम ऑयल एंड असेंशियल ऑयल नो बडी विल सेल यू असेंशियल ऑयल परफ्यूम ऑयल टेलिंग यू दैट इट्स असेंशियल ऑयल नहीं रहते ऐसे दे सेल देम बिकॉज दे आर वेरी परफ्यूम ऑयल आर चीपर Essential oils are very expensive. They're very expensive. This much of a small bottle, a ten ml bottle of perfume oil, might cost you twenty rupees, whereas essential oil will cost you two hundred, three hundred, five hundred sometimes. A ten ml bottle, you know. So perfume oils are very cheap, uh, but they're and they're very strong. They're very heady. But they sir me chale jaate hain. But essential oils are they're milder, but they're very profound in prana. There is a lot of energy in it because they extract of thousands of flowers. को में से इतना सा ऑयल निकलता है यू नो विद द प्रोसेस ऑफ एक्सट्रैक्टिंग असेंशियल ऑयल्स इज लाइक यू नीड सो मेनी फ्लावर्स टू टेक आउट दिस लिटिल एन ऑयल एंड एब्सोल्यूट्स आर देयर इन असेंशियल ऑयल्स देयर एब्सोल्यूट्स व्हिच आर लाइक वेरी स्ट्रांग एंड दे वेरी एक्सपेंसिव बट दे आर वेरी स्ट्रांग एंड वेरी वेरी इफेक्टिव टू डू योर अम यू नो स्पेल वर्क दे आर वेरी इफेक्टिव रोज एब्सोल्यूट एंड जैस्मिन एब्सोल्यूट दीस आर टू ऑयल्स दैट यू शुड हैव For any kind of a floral uh, blending, you, these two, one of these two oils should definitely be combined. साथ में और चार पांच चीजें use कर लो मगर essential uh, absolute of rose and absolute of jasmine yeah. is really so. Yeah, you can you can mix uh, ghee and oils also and keep oil. Uh, पूरा ghee को आप spell cast कर सकते हैं उसमें चीजें डाल करके आप spell cast कर सकते हैं ghee और oils को भी मिलाया जा सकता है almond oil goes very well with uh, pure ghee. uh you can you know blend oil and ghee together and then add some more essential oils to it uh or if you don't want to mix anything else with your pure ghee you can just spell cast pure ghee make the spell and spell cast on the pure ghee and while lighting the lamp say the mantra aap lamp ki jab jalate ho wo mantra zarur bolna and teach everybody in your home to say the mantra you know it's such a strong vibration profound vibration that it stays with your body as you sleep and it goes with you the next day also so very very beautiful nutmeg practice. also has very intense prana nutmeg has a uh, very strong prana bay leaves are considered to be very magical they, although they don't smell anything they don't have their own aroma but they are very magical they are used in a lot of magical rituals in the western uh, wicca tradition bay leaves both use karte hain saffron is okay. very strong saffron is very strong but again it's expensive so saffron oil you get You get saffron oil, essential oil milta hai saffron ka. Who use? Even turmeric oil can... you get. You get cold pressed turmeric oil, the oil which is extracted from turmeric. Even that can be used. Turmeric is also antiseptic and very nice. Uh, it hold. It has a very high level of prana, and uh, holds intention and uh, spells very very profoundly. That's why turmeric is there in all our pujas. You know, our puja videos me sab me turmeric hota hai, because usme ek shamata. इंटेंशन को होल्ड करने की क्षमता बहुत होती है इवनिंग इवनिंग इज कंसिडर्ड टू बी अ नाइस टाइम टू लाइट द दिया बिकॉज पीपल आई वॉल कम होम बच्चे आ गए हैं बाहर से एनर्जी घर में आई हुई है 
you know, um, your interactions in the world, you're carrying a lot of stuff with you in your aura. So the lighting of the lamp in the evening is like a very strong protection to remove all of that. And um, uh, you can make a small dialogue after the chanting of this mantra. For instance, in our Maharashtrian culture, we have a small dialogue that we say after the mantra. Uh, we say something like that, you know, that if there is a place where there is a place, then go outside, go outside, go outside, go outside, go outside, go outside, as a declaration for the house. That, you know, no, no evil is staying into the house and everything has left and uh, all auspiciousness is surrounding us and children are well and you know, essay. So Shaam ka time is uh, auspicious hota hai for two reasons. Practical reason being everybody's come home and now it's time for us to be together again and you know, we need the protection and cleansing. Number two, jo Shaam ka uh, wakt hota hai, dusk ka, uh, it's the coming of the darkness. You know, the light is now going, the sun light is now going and the darkness is coming. So in this darkness, may we be in the light. That is the indication. In this darkness, may we be in the light. And where there is darkness, there is a light of prakash when there is going to be darkness now, I'm lighting the lamp of awareness. So it, it is an ideal time. If you want to do it once in a day, then ideal time is to do it in the evening. And if you feel that evening is not convenient for you for some reasons, and you come late and there are no, people are coming late and whatever, then do it in the morning. Any particular area of the house, we should keep the diya. Uh, all directions are okay. Facing south, I mean south corner, because that's a corner for Yama. So that... Uh, but I always say this all information, uh, Jambura is a program in the head. You know, all the information, Zambura, jitne aap vastu ke rules, feng shui ke rules, padho, ye padho, is a program in the mind. So, uh, professionally, if you are practicing, all the, those things matter, but in your in your house, in your personal space, you don't have programs in your head. There's no, there's no place in my house where there's no God. You know, it's like that. You should have that feeling. There's no place in my house where there's no God, and I can invoke him anywhere. You know, that should be the feeling, and without fear, you should do it without fear. You should do it not having any kind of, uh, uh, you know, blocks about direction. For relationship, combination yeah. of essential oil, pragya, all these that I have given you are very nice even for relationships. The ones, the first five ones are really good for even relationships. And you can add a floral into it. For instance, you know, you have, uh, let's say, sandalwood, uh, sandalwood, cedar wood, orange and lemon hair. Isme aap neroli or add kar sakte khushbu ke liye. And florals uh, enhance love uh, energy, you know. Um, you have the uh, sandalwood set up, uh, frankincense, myrrh, and sandalwood. This way, you rose oil add kar sakte and rose absolute. So it will give a very mesmerizing. And any floral, if you add to these, you know, combinations to these blends, it, will, it can work for love. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Um, can we light different lamps in different rooms, floors of the same house? Yes, you can. If the purpose is different, then you make separate bottles for everybody's room. You can make one bottle for your son's room. You can make one bottle for your living room, for your you know, in-laws and all the people where they are. You can one, make one for your daughter. Keep those bottles in their rooms and light lamps separately. You can do that. But too much of a jamela. You know, bahut sara jamela hai. Unko better ye hai ki brews bana kar ke oil bottles de do aur unko bolo subhi subhi laga lo apne apne. Lamp jalana charo dishaon mein to bada kathin hota hai kaam. Better that you make oils for them, give them in small bottles, tell them anoint this in the morning load rose laga ke jao. But you know, using oils, uh, spell casted oils on your body is mind blowingly effective, I'm telling you. Mind blowingly effective. It can change the way you're thinking, it can change the way you're presenting yourself. And it can completely change the way people look at you. You know, the way people look at you. I'm telling you, it's very, very, very mind-blowing. That, that was really wonderful. This is how, you know, your, your beakers, you know, these beakers, the borosil wale, is may be brew kar sakte aap, magar bhoat dhimi aanj pe, otherwise wo, uh, bhoat dhimi aanj pe rakh kar ke brew kar sakte. It's very beautiful to see this. You know, the word brew, like I told you in the beginning, is not used with oil normally. It's used with water. So, even if you want to make brews, which are, which are not oil-based, we follow the same process that you put spell-casted herbs in water 
और उसको उबालते हैं जैसे काढ़ा बनाते हैं एंड दिस कैन बी यू नो यू पुरा लिड एंड लेट इट कूल डाउन एंड देन स्ट्रेन इट एंड दिस वॉटर दिस ब्रू कैन बी यूज फॉर ड्रिंकिंग इफ द एडिबल अर्ब्स यू पुर और यू कैन यूज दिस टू स्प्रे आप फुसफुस वाली बॉटल में डाल करके घर में स्प्रे कर सकते हैं you know so the same shubham karoti kalyanam can be even put on a on a um, you know bunch of aromatic herbs and brewed in water you know and uh, you can put some essential oils in that water also to give a extra smell and then strain it put it in a puspus ki bottle and spray it everywhere you know aapke furniture pe pardon pe deewaron pe spray kar sakte hain aap bottle mein that's a cheaper option to spread that spell everywhere but of course lighting a lamp is something i would love each one of you to start the practice uh if you if you're not already doing it it is something which is spiritually very uplifting and spiritually very protecting to everyone in the home and brings in a lot of wisdom knowledge and uh, prosperity in your home evening time pe bahut badhiya rehta hai lamp jala kar ke is mantra ko learn kar lijiye and if you learn and if you start practicing i feel i will be blessed you know i feel that it will be a big blessing <laughs> on me theek hai na aur koi question hai bataiye i have a question yes hum lamp ko kabhi bujhate nahi hai right usko apne aap khatam hona chahiye ki hame bujhana chahiye well lo kisi ne kaha hua hai humko bujhana nahi karke hamara dimag mein wo fear baith gaya hai na kisi ne kaha hua hai ki bujhana nahi hai isliye we are scared that bujhaye to kuch ashubh ho jayega aise kuch hota nahi hai if you leaving the house and you don't want to leave a burning तो अपने अपने हाथ से ऐसे बुझा लो उसको या ऐसे ऐसे करके बुझा लो अगेन देर आर सो मेनी ब्लॉक फूक नहीं मारना इसको और ऐसे नहीं करना वैसे तो ये जो ऑल डूज एंड डोज ऑल माइंड प्रोग्राम आई एम टेलिंग यू बिटवीन यू एंड गॉड बिटवीन यू एंड योर प्रैक्टिस देर शुड बी नो बडी डू इट फेयरलेसली विथ लव एंड गो विथ योर ओन यू नो पावर ऑफ डिस्क्रिमिनेशन एंड अपनी रिलीजन यूज करो हाँ जी कैन ऑयल बी ब्रूव इन स्टील यूटेंसिल ऑन अ गैस टो येस यू कैन नंदिता you can you can brew it in a steel utensil also thoda mota bottom ka rehna chahiye nahi to oil kya hota hai wo ek to steel ka bartan bhi lal ho jata hai niche se kala lal aur oil burn ho jate hai iski jo essential values hote hain oil ke khatam hote hain so if you using a steel utensil make sure that it has a thick bottom you know the copper bottom thick one milte hain aajkal take a base oil like sunflower add Uh, add herbs uh, like bay leaf cinnamon vetiver cloves add a few essential oils upon cooling train and use can you give an example of a personal spell once again healthy wealthy lucky and wise slim and beautiful flexible and strong full of energy and light peaceful joyous adored and abundant so blessed and gifted yeah. i am <laughs> माँ एक चीज जो हमें ऑयल ब्रू करना है वो कितनी देर जैसे आपने बोला एक से दो दिन तक उसको ब्रू कीजिए तो वो कितनी देर तक उसको एक दिन ब्रू करें हम पांच दस मिनट बहुत है पांच दस मिनट अगर गैस पे करते हो तो पांच दस मिनट बहुत है जो कोल्ड रॉन्स पे करते हैं ना बाहर उसको क्या करते हैं पहले तेज तेज आग पे पहले ऑयल को रखते हैं फिर लकड़ियां हटा देते हैं सुलगते हुए कोयले होते हैं ना उस पर ब्रू करते हैं मतलब okay. आंच पे ब्रू करते हैं एंड देन आई मीन द विकेट ट्रेडिशन यू नो पीपल डांस अराउंड द पुट म्यूजिक एंड द डांस अराउंड द ऑयल कोल्ड रॉन एंड यू नो द पुट मोर हर्ब्स इन टू एड मेक इट वेरी ड्रामेटिक एंड फुल ऑफ इट्स इंटेंस विद इमोशन यू नो राइट ऑफ इमोशन तो बड़ा सुंदर लगता है आई हैव मेड लाइक दैट आई नो हाउ इट फील इट्स डिफरेंट फ्रॉम वॉट यू फील इन इन योर मदर टंग यू कैन मेक इट इन तेलुगु इन कनाडा you can make your spell in the most loving language that your heart understands beta it's not required to be in english you can all. you can create your oh. own beautiful poem like open sesame open sesame open all the opportunities for me your treasures of this universe come to me you know make some sentence that would first now pehle kya karte hain apni ordinary language mein apni wish ko likhte hain spell banane ka ek hi simple tarika hai pehle apni ordinary language mein apni wish ko apne heart ko likho you know i want opportunities to come in my life i want a lot of money to come in my life i want name fame i want that things should be moving i should be very busy write down all these things and then okay. any words ko combine karke ek kavita bana yeah? okay so right, right. Work and but you need to spend some time with it yeah okay yeah thank you i've been using brewed water for adding to ba- uh, bath but, uh, but can we add a little oil in of course you can vidu yes you can in fact you know you get bath salts you get bath salts and you get herbal bath powders which are very aromatic in down south you get something called javaji 
which is like so aromatic and beautiful. Java ji is used people in Bangalore. It's manufactured in Bangalore and uh, available Chennai, Bangalore side. Lot of people use Java ji. Java ji, choti si bottle milte hai, jisme herbal aromatic powder hota hai. Usme spell casting bahut profoundly hoti hai. You can put a spell for your children or for you know and keep a bottle of Java ji or any herbal aromatic powder or oil and keep it there and add it to the bath uh, bucket. Unki bucket mein do teen drops uske dal ke unko nahane do uske saath. You know, it's a so, very good uh, idea. The question can is, it. can we prepare one common oil and then personalize it as you put into bottles? Right, ma'am. Like, a uh, common oil banaya apne for prosperity, peace, happiness, health, etc. for the family. And then you put in one bottle for your daughter, you put a Saraswati Yantra in it and then you personalize it for her and give it to her. For your boy, you want to do something and whatever challenges he's facing, you personalize it. So, usi oil mein additional intentions dal ke personalize karke aap de sakte ho, barabar kar sakte ho. Absolutely you can do it. Thank you so much.